What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the vlog. We have some really exciting stuff happening in this video. We are working on some of the post trim details and also getting our fireplace wall ready for veneer stone. So make sure you hit subscribe. Stay tuned. What am I doing with this? I'm building something. Why don't you watch and learn, dude? See my new tools I got? You know what I actually really have been enjoying? What? I got that electric razor scooter. Yeah. I get my mail. Yeah, for sure. That's awesome. Yeah. No I know. Everybody is probably like, who's this new guy in the neighborhood riding this Razor scooter? I'd have it in my house, like going to the fridge. That's a good call. All right. All right. It's a nice looking wall. Let me just double check this here. What do we got? 41 and 5 ace. Oh! Uh, ooh. Okay, so. waiting my turn but nothing stops business <laughs> i understand that 803-939 by the time this video comes out that code will no longer be of use so hackers can uh take it easy right here what we've got is our fireplace opening this looks huge and uh it is gonna be a decent size uh fireplace here but uh, it is going to be slightly hidden, so it's a linear style fireplace. Um, we're going to have, I think, the viewing area. The viewing area starts at around six and a half inches off of the deck, and then there is a pretty large area here, about 18 inches on the top, that is uh, not visible as well. So that'll be behind here. This is the only area here uh, above the viewing portion of the fireplace because that stops about here. Uh, that needs to be non-combustible. So we'll do a piece of hardy board or cement board um, on top of the unit here. And that's pretty much it. Everything else can be framed with wood as we've done. And uh, now that we have the rough opening done here, we can get this thing all sheathed up and kind of get it, get it ready to go. It's gonna be sick. It's gonna be really sick. I was why, for a level. why are you walking up on me like that? Because that's just how I walk. You know? Be careful. Walk like you're the king or you don't give an F who the king is. Yeah, exactly. All right. <laughs> Who's the king here? <laughs> you know the answer. <laughs> you know the answer. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? We uh, got some here? Uh, some deck boards. Some decorators, uh, seven and a quarter Kaya. We're throwing it up for our, our beams. Yeah, we're covering our beams in it. Looks good already. That's a nice yeah. miter you did up there. Yeah, it's not too bad. Love that. Yeah, so unfortunately it was it's bigger than 20 feet, so I had to create a seam, and I didn't yep. want to put the seam above the door, yep. so I shot it back in the window. Nice. We'll get this piece up. Um, that allows us to... Uh, Let's talk about this here. Talk about this. It's called a route. Yeah. 
I had to take some, I had to, I had some chew material out of the back of it because uh, we got these pesky brackets on it. Um, so you go around, measure for those, route the depth out. So when you put your board up, it can sit flat against the material and not those pesky brackets uh, pushing it out of the way. Uh, right? All right, yeah. So we'll see. We'll see. You put this up here. I just I need to. Have you seen the two foot level? Huh? Have you seen the two foot level? I mean, I got two feet. What's up, bud? Hey, do you want to be in the video, bud? Yeah. This one? Yeah. Say hi. Hey. What are you doing here? Uh, Say hi. Yeah. What do you think? How's the deck look, Max? Good? Like, yeah? Oh, no. All right. Do you want to help? Oh, no? Okay. Well, he did say, I want to go, I want to go back in Catherine's vein. Want to color something? Or do you want to play? play? Wait, Max, I heard that yeah. you went to a tractor store. Yeah. Did you go to the tractor store with Daddy? I want to stay at home. You want to stay at home? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you said you wanted to go in Catherine's van again. I want my music. You want your music? I want my music. I want my music. Let me sit on your lap in Catherine's van. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, now we're getting it. Now we're getting that nice good action on that. You're gonna thank me when you still have a hand at the end of the day, okay? Two and three quarter plus. Thirty-two and three quarter plus zero. No, twenty-eight and three quarters. <laughs> twenty-eight. <laughs> yeah. What? Well, this isn't twenty-eight. Yes, I don't it know. is measured again. Thirty. No, thirty-one and three quarter plus. I don't know what you were doing, but oh, I don't know what those. Oh, they're for. Uh... Oh, okay. Yeah. Tell it to the. Yeah, thirty-one whatever. and three quarters. Okay. Well. But you got a whole stack. Well, I only need two. Well, I guess I'm gonna need like one more. Okay. So what's going in there? Uh, we got a double access door with a drawer on top. A drawer on top? Yeah, it's got a uh, like a long drawer. And what's in there? Nothing. Oh. Just one door. We were gonna do two, two doors, but figured, you know. It's not really a like, great storage. Sean. Yes. Can I spend $437 on 30 engraved tumblers? To give our clients? 
Yeah, can't people don't. Need, the world doesn't need more tumblers. You know? I disagree. People love getting those things. Yeah, but then they use them once and it sits in their truck forever and rots. Okay. A what? What about a water bottle instead of a tumbler? Um. Now you're now you're getting somewhere. This was, ah, oh, damn it, this was the piece I just cut. <laughs> I cut a piece off of it. Oh, jeez. You guys hear me? We're in mensjournal.com. Is it like well-men? Just... No, 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 it's men's. Oh, okay. Sick. And yahoo.com. Oh. Now, I don't know what those, what, those pieces were like 28 or something. I don't know what they were for, but we do need pieces in here. Oh, uh, they are actually for, I thought we were building the top uh. And it was for like that wall. And uh, 20, three quarter. Roger that. Man, it's really turning out nice. And what are you doing on that ladder? Just confused. I'm doing research. I am out here getting Wi-Fi. Oh, okay. I came up here to look at the fireplace and then I just never got down. And, oh, okay. I don't know, it's kind of comfortable. Secret, premiere, inventory stuff. Okay. Start excavating our patio, but we've got rain on the forecast for the next three days. So at least I want to fill in this trench, and the rain, if anything, is going to help compact that soil into our trench. And uh, you know, we'll go back and compact it later, but we want to get this done before the rain starts.
Shout out, shout out. A lot of people would kill to have somebody like me at their disposal all day, ain't so. So you can see, six by six post, full deck board thickness on both sides. What do I got? Seven and three sixteenths. We've got the decorator seven and a quarter inch board that's gonna go over here and it's just gonna have the ever so slight overhang uh, on both sides. But we love doing it like this because we don't have to rip anything. It's a super durable way to do this. There's no miters or cuts or anything. Everything can be plugged because it's that full thickness board and uh, it's easy, so looks clean, easy, gotta love it. The, the framing there is, is the rough opening. Uh. Huh? <laughs> what do you mean, uh? Don't give me that, uh. I framed that and I measured it. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. You need an attitude adjustment. And you know what that comes with? Uh. Face adjustment. From this. Should have just left this in there until it was ready. I got a good head for noogies. A little bit smaller. All right, so uh, let's see. It's uh, just um, here. So cut this one out first. The cut doesn't have to be super clean, so you can just cut it with a circular saw. You're doing a horrible job. Stop, stop with that. You kind are. Of, I know, I couldn't see, but I'm doing a better job over here. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. She doesn't understand. That's perfect. We got our trim up. Look at how nice this looks. Super, super nice. Love that. Kathy! Yep. Yeah. You gonna cut for me? Yeah. 49 and a quarter. We need a rough opening of 36, but we're also gonna trim out the inside of that opening with a piece of decorator. So one inch for that. So our framed opening needs to be 38. So let's say 49 and a quarter minus 38, 11 and a quarter, but we want to come in the same on both sides, so we'll divide that by two. Both sides need to be 5.625, which is five ace. Four pieces, two by four, at five and five ace. You want to pre-drill? I'll pre-drill all of them. Yeah, could you? Because I don't have a drill out here. That's okay. Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Who's going to go faster?
Oh no, I'm out of nail screws, screws. Screws, screws, screws. Why'd you have to do it with air parentheses? Are you guys racing? Sorry, but when you become such a good carpenter, you gotta do things to keep things interesting because uh, everything else is just mundane. You'll get it one day. Hey, what the heck are you doing? Catherine. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Aunt. I still gotta help you lead here. Getting my steps in. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a very high number, and I wouldn't believe it. What other way? <laughs> I don't want to scrape it on the ground. Well, you can't do it the, the way you're doing it. Uh, not with your attitude, I suppose. Who invited this guy? That's too much of an angle. Yes, it is, eh? <laughs> oh, what's happening there, huh? Oh, what's that? Oh, you did. Well, what's it doing there, huh? What do you call that? Uh That's not going anywhere. <laughs> that took entirely too long. Where am I drill back? It's too late in the day. <laughs> Should have cut it a half inch shorter. <laughs> Next up, we've got this beautiful mortarless veneer stone wall. We've got the Adorn Premier Outdoor Living Series. Premier Series. Acadia. This wall is going to be freaking awesome. We've got some cool details going on the inside of this fireplace wall as well. So you're going to have to wait for the next video to see all of that. Make sure you hit subscribe, stay tuned. And until next time, this has been Premier Outdoor Living. <laughs>